Good afternoon and welcome back to Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. My name is Justin Smith and today we're going to do another video on a brand new arrival here at the dealership. Now we have over 30 Pro Masters in stocks between seven passengers and nine passengers and this is a 2016 model that just came in. This specific model is done in the deep cherry red. This is built on the 159 inch wheelbase so it is the nine passenger conversion van. Now, just like all of our ProMaster conversion vans here at the dealership, they are all on the front wheel drive platform paired to a V6 motor or the three liter uh, eco diesel motor. Now, this particular nine passenger will accommodate uh, just a little north of 20 miles to the gallon and uh, move nine people in extreme comfort. Now, this particular van, just like all the vans here at the dealership, has full body paint, including the front fascia, fender trim, mirrors, running boards, door handles, all brilliantly painted to match. Um, all of our vans do feature privacy glass up on the front two doors. Now, these are done in a 30% window tent to stay compliant in all 50 states. Now, moving along to the back of the van, you'll notice the back windows are a little bit darker. This is a factory 5% limo tent and uh, ensures the best of privacy and protection from the sun. Now, this particular van does have the 18-inch chrome wheels. Now, we do have a 16-inch wheel available if you choose to go that route. And if you need more information on that, feel free to give me a call and I can explain what they look like and, and even get you some pictures. All right, now I want to take this time at the very back of the van to go over some important safety features and also some of the capabilities that the ProMaster has to offer. Now, starting with the safety features, um, all of our ProMasters are equipped with a factory backup camera, and that is mounted dead center top of the van. A lot of manufacturers like to put the backup camera off to one side, and it doesn't really give you an accurate visual of what's behind you. It can be very deceptive. So this is an awesome system, and it, and, and it works tremendously. So the way that the system works, as soon as you put the vehicle in reverse, you're going to get a nice visual of whatever might be behind you on the factory navigation screen. And we will show you with more detail once we get inside the van. But sticking with uh, the other safety features, uh, this van is equipped with anti-lock brakes, traction control, hill start brake assist, and also rollover mitigation, which is extremely important in a high profile vehicle. Now, if you have any questions on how any of those specific features work, feel free to give me a call and I can get into better detail. Now, moving along to capability. I mean, this is a nine passenger conversion van loaded to the gill. So, you know, extreme comfort. You can take nine people and tow that boat to the lake with this thing. All of our ProMasters will tow 5,100 pounds, even with the gas motor. Quite impressive for a front wheel drive vehicle. Okay, now I want to take this time to go over the very best part of a conversion van, right? The inside. Um, and I tell you, I'm in these vans every single day. Um, and we do offer pre-owned vans here, so it really does help put this van into perspective, uh, even for me being in them all the time, just how much room there are. Um, you know, the, the old vans were great, um, but having a front wheel drive um, and a factory raised roof just is awesome. I mean, the interior space in this thing is phenomenal. You know, it's, it's taller, it's six foot four, interior height inside. It's wider. Um, it just gives you a lot more leg room in every aisle than any nine passenger I've ever been in. Um, so it's, it, it really is awesome. And not to mention all the electronics in this thing. Uh, a lot of the conversion van companies like to put, build a center console in between the front seats. And that's a great idea. Nothing against that. But it makes it a little difficult to get from the front to the back because you've got to step over that console uh, slash cooler and duck for the TV. Um, in the ProMaster, we decided to put everything right here on this wall. Um, everything that you would find in the old style console is right here. And it's actually better placed um, because, you know, when I'm turned around in the normal seating position, I have easy access to everything here instead of have to bend down and reach for the old style um, equipment. And our van has all the goodies that you would expect to find in a conversion van. Um, rear heat and air system, and that works with this uh, Pro Air 2 digital thermostat. It's pretty much one step set and forget. Awesome system. Um, our rear radio is located right here um, on the side wall as well. So, you know, you've, you've got the option to listen to different music in the back of the, the van um, via headphone. 
um, and it does have Bluetooth capabilities. So an iPad, iPod, cell phone, um, kids or adults can control their own music content with one touch of a button and it's great. And mom and dad can listen to whatever they want to in the front of the van. So that's a really cool feature. Now this radio is also designed to work with the television in this van. Uh, and it does give you a true home theater experience in this van uh, if you want to watch a movie through, through the kicker speakers in the back of this van, not the headphones. Um, the television in this van is a super um, awesome TV. It is a 32 inch Vizio 240 hertz LED smart television. So it's got all the goodies that you'd expect to find in all the smart gadgets today. YouTube, Netflix, Pandora, even Facebook. Um, and that is paired up to an LG smart Blu-ray player as well. So um, you can, you know, run applications either off the uh, DVD interface or off the TV. So all that stuff's included and all you need is a Wi-Fi hotspot or a connection uh, to, to make that equipment work. Now all of our ProMasters have overhead storage. As you'll notice above, even our low top ProMaster has overhead storage. And these are located all the way around the top of the van. It's just great little area to put knickknacks, blankets, umbrellas, DVDs, remote controls, um, you know, just help to keep uh, the clutter off the floor. Now, as I mentioned, all of our vans do have a 5% limo tent in the back uh, of, the, of the van. But we also have these really nice privacy shades as well, just to give you a little more protection from the sun or maybe a little more privacy. And we have those back behind this recessed wall. And I think that the design turned out re really good. Um, and they're real, real nice, sturdy, easy to use. Um, and those are located on every window in the back of the van. Now, the captain shares that I'm sitting on are very special captain shares. Um, first off, they're on a swivel base, real nice, soft touch, perforated leather. Um, they do have the hooks down in here for child safety seats. Um, and all the captain's chairs have these hooks. So you can accommodate four car seats in the back of this van. These are not located on the rear sofa for anybody wondering. So the captain's chairs are equipped to either have a front facing car seat or a rear facing car seat. Now, these seats all do feature power recline. And because they are swivel, we did incorporate the seat belt inside the seat. So no matter what position you're facing, either forward or back, you're going to be safe and secure at all times. Okay, now I'm in the very back of the van, the third row, the power sofa. And I tell you, the roominess continues even all the way back here. Again, I'm six foot two, sitting with my legs crossed in, on the rear sofa here. And I've probably got, you know, a good eight inches um, of space before the, the captain chair in front of me. And again, I, you know, I've never been in a nine passenger van that can actually seat nine full size adults and everybody be comfortable. Certainly you can do that in all the Pro Masters and it's, um, it's awesome. It really is. Now the sofa that I'm sitting on is a power uh, sofa. So it has the capability to, to move forward or back. So I guess to give yourself a little more leg room uh, in the third row or maybe slide the chair up to give you a little more storage back behind the rear sofa, you have that capability. Now it also does recline as well, uh, as you notice here. So if you want to get a little angle on the back while you're watching a movie, you can do that very easily as well. Now if you hold that recline button all the way down, the sofa will actually fold completely flat and can be utilized with the captain's chair in front of it to accommodate somebody as tall as me, um, you know, sleep overnight in the van or maybe just get some rest on that long trip. And uh, it's equally as comfortable as the captain's chair. That's always been the problem with the rear sofa and conversion vans. Nobody wanted to sit back there. Um, not the same support, not the same comfort. Uh, rest assured, uh, we didn't cut any corners on this rear sofa. Um, equally as comfortable, I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Okay, now I want to take this time to demonstrate the very front of this van. Now, of course, the back of the van is loaded with all the goodies, but that transfers up to the front as well with all the modern amenities that you'd expect to find in any current vehicle. Um, starting with all the power equipment, uh, the van does have power windows on both sides, does have uh, heated, I'm sorry, power mirrors um, on both sides. 
and they do have a one touch collapse feature as well so if you got to tuck it in a tight space you can bring the mirrors right into the van that's a neat feature as well and while i'm on the the mirrors i never uh, ever talk about this in the video even the blind spot mirrors power um, the only vehicle I've ever seen that the blind spot mirror is power. Usually you got to wiggle it around with your finger. The top part's power, but the blind spot uh, mirror is even power. And that's an extremely important feature people don't realize, especially in a big vehicle such as this. You want to make sure you, you've got every um, advantage that, that you can to, to uh, protect the van and keep you from getting in an accident. Um, the, the steering wheel in this van does have a real nice leather uh, wrap steering wheel um, with steering wheel controls on both sides of the airbag. Now these are going to control multiple different features, uh, mainly mainly the radio uh, features, give you the ability to change sources, lower the volume up and down obviously, uh, change channels, answer a hands-free phone call through the factory navigation system. Uh, so that's a really cool feature to have and, and people always want to know, does it have Bluetooth? Yes it does. Um, we have uh, USB connectivity in the front of this van that is wired directly to the back of this radio. So not only will it charge your device, you can transfer music files directly to this Uconnect 5.0 radio. Now it does also come with a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary input as well. So you can uh, transfer music uh, through that source as well. Uh, gear shifters, real nice, nicely laid out right up here on the dashboard, easy to access, um, easy to go from park to drive, drive back to uh, park, not a problem. Um, the air conditioning and heat controls are laid out real nice on this van with just three simple rotary dials, easy to reach from either seat in the front of this van, um, real simple. Um, so I like simple things, easy, easy to, easy to uh, use. A lot of manufacturers are very busy these days with tons of buttons. So, um, you know, easiness of use is not going to be a problem in the front of this van. As far as charging goes, uh, the passenger does have a USB charging port in front of his seat as well. This one is only for charging. It is not connected to the radio. There's also a DC port for charging. Um, as far as storage goes in the front of this van, we do have two glove boxes. We have one on top of the airbag and a more standard glove box down below and a nice little storage tray right here also. We do have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six cup holders in the front of this van. So um, I don't ever want to hear that somebody's thirsty riding around here because you got plenty of storage for drinks. Um, the, the navigation system, I apologize, is the Uconnect 5.0. Um, it does feature a CD player, AM, FM radio, um, and is a five, uh, five inch touchscreen uh, navigation system. Now our navigation in this van uses a TomTom -Tom interface. So a lot of you are already familiar with that. And again, with manufacturers trying to um, you know, cram so much te technology in vehicles these days, um, it, it takes forever to figure it out. This thing is probably the easiest navigation system I've ever used. Uh, works beautiful. Okay, now I want to talk about the seats in the front of this van. All the seats in our ProMasters are wrapped with the same material that we use in the back of the van. And they are um, on an eight-way adjustable pedestal. So you've got multiple adjustments in the front of this van. Even the armrest uh, you can adjust and lock in different positions. And yes, they do come with heat. So we have factory heat in all of our ProMaster conversion vans. And uh, that pretty much wraps up uh, the inside, the outside of this 2016 159.9 passenger. Once again, my name is Justin Smith, and I'd like to thank you for joining us here at Paul Sherry Conversion Vans today. And we hope you enjoyed the video that we did of this brand new 2016 Sherry Ram Pro Master 9 passenger conversion van. Now, if there was anything that I might not have covered in this video, please don't hesitate to call. I'm usually around. If I'm not around, Brian's around. Somebody's around to answer your questions on our Pro Master conversion vans. And for those of you that like the videos that we do or might not have found that perfect co conversion van yet, maybe it's not the right color, maybe not the right interior, I kindly ask that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and even like us on Facebook because that's going to let you know sooner 
that we have a van that might work here for you at the dealership. Thanks again and have a wonderful day. The Bushy Mike. Brought to you by the Bushy Mike. Yeah, can we talk to Bushy Mike, please? <laughs>